Fu Show here. In this video, I'm going to show you how to replace wiper blade refills on your Honda. This video applies to standard design wiper blades only, not the one-piece beam blades that Honda started putting on vehicles in the mid-2000s. These refills will only work with OEM Honda blades, so if you purchased aftermarket ones, you'll need to pick up some OE blades at the dealer. You could pick them up for around $10 a blade. With the Honda blades, you can restore your streaky or noisy wipers to new condition by replacing just the refills for around 7 bucks, which is less than one replacement blade from the auto parts store. Here's a look at the replacement refills. The shorter one, which goes on the passenger side, is part number 76622SF4305, and the longer one that goes on the driver's side is part number 76622SM4305. These part numbers are for 94 to 97 Accords. Consult your dealer for the proper part numbers for your vehicle. Now to remove the refill, you have to find out which side it's locked on. If you look at this side, you'll see that the refill's straight. This isn't where it's locked. If you look at the other side, you'll see that it's not straight. It has a little ramp here, a little ramp here, a little recess where the hooks from the wiper blade lock on. So to remove the refill, you're going to want to grab it right here, and then you're going to want to pull in this direction. Now there's two parts you'll be recycling from the old refill. That's these two metal spines that insert into the sides here. So pull those out. Then you can get rid of the old refill. Now you insert the spines into the new refill. You want to insert them in this groove all the way at the top. Then once you've got it started, you could just run your finger down and it'll fall into place. Then repeat the process for the other one. Start it on one side, then just run your finger down. Now the wiper blade has claws, and you want them to slide into this groove directly above the metal spine. And then just feed it through. Now you want to make sure that the claws get on the groove on this side and the opposite side. Another thing I should mention, it doesn't matter which side of the wiper blade you insert the refill into. The locking holes on the refill will lock onto the claws on either end of the blade. When you're inserting it, just make sure that the side of the refill with the locking holes is facing away from the blade. Just slowly guide it through, making sure that the claws get into that groove directly above the metal spines. Okay, now we're at the point where we're going to lock the refill to the blade so it doesn't come out. Now it's the exact opposite of when you removed it. You're just going to grab here and pull until these two claws sink into that hole. So give it a pull. And that's it. Then double check to make sure all of the claws are in the proper groove. and repeat the process on the other side. Locate where the locking holes are on the refill. In this case, they're on this side. You grab the refill, pull to those claws released from the hole, slide the refill out.
Again, start it on one side, push it to the end. And once you've got it started, just hold it with one finger and then run your finger across and it'll fall into the rest of the refill. Flip it over, repeat the same process on the other side. Again, the side of the refill with the locking hole should be facing away from the blade and the side without them should be facing towards it. Then check the claws again on both sides.